laptops, they're going to be subtly amazing for their price points. Yes. Yes. Um, I got I got the very first uh, two two years ago now uh, when Asus put out their Strix line, the yeah. first one. Um, I still can't buy something that is comparable to what I bought two and a half years ago. It drives me slightly batty because I'm like I'm like ah I've, I've had this computer for two and a half years like my brain tells me I should upgrade but I can't right now I have to wait another six or seven months yeah um, because it's that it's that first that first like outing where they're like we want to push the ball so far ahead because uh, I had bought an MSI um, and it was just uh, it was too flexy in the keyboard area mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I went back and the guys like you should get the Strix it's just all around better it's like and I'll give you an extra two hundred dollars off of it. And nice. I was like, I was like, oh man, you sold me on that. <laughs> and he was like, so the problem is it's got a tiny ding right there. And I was like, uh, in order to see that ding, I have to flip the computer over. And if the computer's upside down, it's not being a computer. So right. <laughs> I'll, I'll take your two hundred dollars off. Nice, nice. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Well, uh, this is what in the industry we call a cold open. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, so my name's Rich. And I'm here with Sean, uh, um, and and also, and also Eric, who is off camera today. Well, for now. At this exact same, uh, technically, I'm not. I mean, I could just shove my hand in the middle of the camera. Well, you right could. Now and you, be like, I'm on camera. But you could. You could yeah, do that. I am not going to be playing in this game at this moment. We'll see what happens from there. That's right. I'm also working on the link so I can get it out there. Okay. I have the link. I just need to finish the post. All right, cool. So no one probably will see this right now. But I was watching you guys have that conversation on, on the stream. on the stream. It was a very surreal moment. Yeah, it was, it was pretty good. <laughs> so so anyway, uh, we're gonna play some Transformers um, as always, and uh, it's the almost optimal beasting against. We're gonna just call this cars with cliff jumper. Yeah, I have um, a cliff jumper, so my cars deck has cliff jumper. There you go. That's that seems like a good use a reason to. Uh, to roll with that. Um, all right, cool. So how we do it here is, you know, we we cut, we roll for player first, and then we just roll in. Cool. You ready to go? I'm ready. All right, cool. I think this is the first time that this deck might have been running up against any form of car. Wow. It is. All right. So... That'd be kind of cool. I have, I have oh. not successfully Whoops. built a cars deck that I have piloted against. I built you a cars deck. Yep. Six, but I haven't played it. Ten. Um, I'll go first. All right. My brain just completely left. Uh, Can I draw a card? Yes. Whew. I was about to ask if, you, j- if, you, did, if you did that yet. I don't play anything. Nope. Um, <clears throat> let's see. We <clears throat> will... <sighs> flip Prowl. All right. And since I flipped to bot mode... Draw a card with Cliff Jumper. Cool. Um, and then we will just go Prowl at Well, I hate Optimus, so we're gonna go at Optimus. Okay. So that's uh, six against six. Cool. Cool. Um, And I will not pick up the bashing shield. All righty. And we'll draw a card. Um, Let's see here. What do I want to do? We're going to flip B. 
And we're going to put a money pick on him. And then we'll attack Brel. Uh, I'm not going to plan. So. Well, that was uh, unproductive. Yeah. All right, so that's seven on your two. So I will slap five down on Prowl. All right. I feel like I didn't shuffle well enough. All right, and then we'll pass turn. Right. Draw my card. Um. We will Okay, uh, I will go ahead and attach to Wheeljack. Oh, and uh, I'll draw a card since I've upgraded. Yep. And then I will scrap a card. All right. I will then um, I did that slightly out of order. Oh well. We'll flip wheel jack. I'll draw a card from Cliff Jumper. Um, do I want to play an action? I will. I will play Supercharger on Wheeljack, bring his bold up to six. That's a lot of bold. Um, and we will go, of course. At B. At B. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, plus, plus five, mm -hmm. plus four. So, eight, no, twelve. Sorry. Is that right? I'm not actually helping there. I uh, that worse. 17 total. That's 17. Yep. Uh, defend 2, take 15. And that's B in one shot. That is truly one shotting a character. Yes. And then I will discard, press the advantage to take a bashing shield up into my hand. On All a right. side note, yep. how many decks do we have that have rollouts in them? I don't know. Uh, and then the grenade launcher goes away. And I will draw. Um, I'm going to transform off this. Because that's what you do. Yeah. Um, then... A little plasma burst root wheel jack. That's two. That's two. Yep. <clears throat> and then we'll attack into wheel jack. Um Well, that was not something I want wanna see. Um so that's eight into your one. Mm. Sitting on him. All right, over to me. Yep. Let's see. Um,
Okay. I will play Start Your Engines. We will flip back to car mode. Then we'll untap Wheel Jack. So everyone's got Bull 2 happening right now. All right. Um, we will then upgrade Wheeljack to draw a card. All right. Sorry. And we'll flip Wheeljack. You start your engine. It's not in your scout yet. Oh, yes, yeah, sorry. Um, to draw a card from Cliff Jumper. And then uh, he'll come at Optimus with a bold five. All right. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Uh, so 13. All right. Take 11. Cliff Jumper will attack. He's got bold two happening. One, two, one, two. So eight. Uh, and then your pip. White pip. Oh, I did have a white pip. Ten. All right. Um, defend three. Take. Seven. Good game. So this is why this deck was stupid, and I had to build it, because that the guy I played <coughs> uh, on uh, just obliterated everything I had. Just completely went through everything like a hot knife through butter. And I was like, I don't... I don't understand. Yeah. Um, the thing is... is 23 car stars? Yes. Yes. Uh, two... Where are they? Oh, you don't have to show me if you don't want to. I just... Mount the missiles. Uh, oh, yes. The yeah, sound is, that sounds like a mounted missile would do mounted well. Mounted missiles. Yeah, yeah. Uh, two mounted missiles. Yeah, that, it, it, that makes sense. Um, so what I'll say... Not a dig at anything, but I mean, Cliff Jum Jumper didn't do anything miraculous in that, so I think it's hilarious. Uh, no, Burr drew four cards. That's yeah, three cards, but right. uh, and one of those was the second grenade launcher, which was important because then I could wheeljack scrap a card. I think I just ignored Cliff Jumper in general because I don't know what he does. Because... We don't own him, so well, he doesn't exist in my brain. Well, you got his friend Slipstream now. Yeah, but yeah. you know, there was that. I don't know Slipstream does either because it was like. Mm. <laughs> well, Slipstream's actually really good. Yeah, I yes. know, I've heard. That's a plane, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah, right there. Yeah. Someone on stream, that's me, got lucky and bought a pack for under market value a few months back. Still more than it cost when you got it at San Diego Comic-Con, but right. definitely under market value. And or Gen Con, apparently. Yeah. It's pretty cool. And I only really wanted Cliff Jumper, so I have given the Slipstream and the two actions to Bacon Ice Cream Productions. And Team RTFC. And Team RTFC, which I'm a member of. I... The, oh, you didn't watch the video yet. I plugged that you were going to be here today. <laughs> yes. And that you were a founding member of Team RTFC. So don't worry. I plugged that for the six people that watched. I actually don't, didn't look at any of the stats, but the, not many people that watched it, but I did say you were coming and you were a founding yep. member. And we uh, appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I uh, no, I absolutely plugged that you were 
And I was like, I know this is happening unless he dies or gets super duper sick, like last time. Okay. But I don't think we, last time you were supposed to be here, I don't think we had any of the stuff to actually start recording. No. I think we had, like, the lights. Yeah, we had the we lights had the real early. Yeah. We might have had that camera. The big we, camera. We, we had the Brio, yeah. Rich's dad made these while they were on vacation so that we could oh, show That's fantastic. Yep. Yeah. yeah, that's pretty cool. Because one of the things I really wanted to do, whether I'm a good player or not, I don't know. All right. My tournament record has, has shown me that I am not that good, but whatever. <laughs> um, the All right. Not knowing what what's in someone's hand when they make a decision is really hard. Like, I, I've watched Wrecking Roll go back and forth and say, like, oh, if I had done this, and it's like, you don't know, you know, most of the time you can't see what's in people's hands unless they're flashing it to the camera. Yeah. And that's one of the things that I was like, could we figure out a way to do it? No, yeah, I, I absolutely. Like it. I, I like it because I think it, it, it adds it adds value in determining how the sequence of events went. Because I'm sure, like, someone else could watch the stream and go, oh, he should have done this and this and could have, right. cur you know, knocked a whole turn off. Yep. Um, or I suboptimal played the entire game. Right. Um, yeah. All right, cool. So I think I'm going to go first this time. Cool. Sounds like a good so, I mean, I would, yeah. Again, I'm going to go back and ask my question, which is, where the hell did we put all our rollouts? I mean, there are three in this deck. Yeah, I know, but we have more than three. Yes. I'm just trying to figure out where two others are. Oh. It's the only card right now that is not sleeved for this. Huh. Was it in that other deck? Well, maybe it just rolled out. Maybe. Mm. Oh, you do. Look oh in here. I forgot there was another deck in here. That's yep. what I was missing. Um, do do do. I thought I took part of everything else. So this is the part where I just go all out because I got blown out last time. <laughs> um, and we flip Optimus, and then we go at Wheeljack, and then I pray I flip something that's cool. Nope, not in here. Um, these are these. Huh. Right, because you pick before like, I flip, right? Yes. So yeah, I pick before you flip. I mean... Mm-hmm. Yeah, I, do you, I, you just whack for three? I would. I, I personally or, would. Or do you or do you play the just kidding and throw B out there? Here's the question: Is three damage better or worse than attacking with Optimus Prime, Prime twice? You uh, want to attack with Optimus Prime twice. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You swap missions. So, that. so, yep. So I go just kidding, and B's coming at you instead. No, no, that's not... No? No. Okay. It is not that B's coming at him. The attack oh, is still oh. resolving with Optimus Prime. It's just Optimus Prime is no longer tapped. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, everything is yes. still running off of the tap. Right. Off the yeah, 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 yeah. It's I, for I, I forgot yeah. how that works. Well, uh, and more importantly, uh, I have to now attack Bumblebee. Yes. Exactly, yes. Okay, so I just go ahead and take six. Yep. And then these go away. Yeah. And then it's your turn. Can I just assemble this? Yeah, absolutely. I forget even what that was. It was a uh, stun defense. Okay. The event that we did. That's fine. Silence is brought to you by the letter not playing. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I watched I a lot of Sesame Street in the last couple of days, okay? Well. So we will fool. Oh, no, hold, hold. Uh, 
because I can only do one or the other. So we will f put the grenade launcher down on Prowl. I will draw a card. Okay. I will then... Scrap a card. I will then flip him to bot mode. Okay. I will draw a card. And then Prowl will attack B. B. All right. One, two, so ten. All right. Defend four, take six. And then Grenade Launcher goes to the scrap pile. All right. And we'll draw. And hmm. we'll play confidence. Always a good choice. We'll draw two cards. I was thinking <clears throat> about the bottom of confidence. Yep. And then we scrap oh, that you two. Can play the extra action. That you can play an action, yeah. Oh, okay. we scrap two cards. I forgot that it digs. I was just like, you can play an extra action. Like, why was this earlier? Yeah. Okay. Um. Scrap two. Confidence was when you saw that combo deck that, like, everyone was like, "Oh my god, this is breaking everything." Yeah. Um, and I put it together and I play tested. I just fishbowled it just to see, and scrap two. Confidence was one of those things that I was like. This takes a lot of time to figure out what things I want to discard. And then I can drawing that many times. Then yeah. I can play an action. Yeah. Yes, you can. Did you just discard a leap of faith? I did. Okay. There's a there's a brainstorm. Um. Then there's a leap into battle for Optimus. Um. And we'll plasma burst wheeljack. <clears throat> what did wheeljack ever do to you other than one hit a bumblebee? <laughs> <laughs> um, and then we'll attack Prowl with Optimus Prime. Yeah, seems good. Uh, well, should I? Mathing this out, I think I've so I've got eleven right now, twelve. I've got twelve on the on the table. Mathematically, you should go for pep talk. Yeah, yep, sure. yep. So then we're gonna pep talk. Because, as in any game, card advantage is still super important. All right. Uh, and so I only got one, which is not enough, and Prowl dies. I prowl. One is not enough. When she was one of your cards was KO'd. Uh, I can't remember if uh, when Prowl himself is being KO'd, does he trigger himself? One, one of your other cars. When one of your cars. When one of your cars is KO'd. Right, he is not a car right now. Right. Never mind. I am completely having a moment. Everyone ignore me. I, <clears throat> I'm part of Team RTFC. In case For you a don't reason. Know, don't know what RTFC is. Uh, people just look it up. <laughs> oh, I'll drop it. I don't care. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna draw a card. You really need to shuffle better. Um, all right. So um, first action will be to uh, play confidence. So we're gonna draw, and then we're gonna draw. Um. And then I have to scrap two, which will be those two. I still have an action. Do I have to play the action immediately, or is it a floating no, action? No, it, it, it has been said. It, it's now there 
If you play anything else, you you lose that. Okay, so I have to play an action. You got to play an action, yeah. yeah. If you want, yeah. if you want to play it, you have to. Okay. It's not. There's not a stack, but there's a stack. Cool. Everyone cool. wants to ignore the fact that there's a stack, but there. It's unofficially a stack, or a chain in versus. In L five R, did it have a term? I don't remember. No, because no, that was just back and forth. Play the card, resolve it. And then we will play confidence. All right. Cycle, cycle, cycle. Uh, and then we will get those. Um, I still function prowl. Okay. Um, we will then flip him. Yeah, because then he gets bold three. Because he's there's a. Uh huh. And then I draw a card. Okay. What, what's your question? Do you guys care if I interject and ask the question? Sure. It may it may impact the outcome though. Mm. That's well, up to it's up to you, both. You of can you. I mean you can ask you. Yeah wait. yeah whatever whatever man we're just playing. Why not transform Prowl since he's gonna die? Give everyone bolt two and then that bolt six instead of bolt three. Because he's getting bold three by flipping the bot mode, but Prowl gives so, everyone bold two, right? Right. So if I flip him, well, yes, that makes way more sense. Um, but I don't. I'm just asking the question. I want. I'm trying to logic out why you're why you would choose to do the wheel jack over. Because you get to attack with everyone this turn, so it's the prime opportunity to take advantage of multiple bolts from him. No, that makes that makes perfect sense. I was thinking in terms of digging for a, an upgrade for Wheeljack. Got but, it. Okay. Um, and th that answers my question. No, that no, that works perfectly because I can then just upgrade Prowl. Uh, well, away. that's going to go away. I'll upgrade Cliff Jumper. And I still get to draw a card from Wheeljack, but then I have to scrap a card. Um, <clears throat> cool. Sorry, I no, just no, wanted to. No, ask no, no. That no, I I didn't think it through, and I don't play enough to to get it. So Prowl uh, will come swinging at Optimus. All right. So there's one, two, and then one, one, two. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten. Ten, taking eight. And then Wheeljack will come at Optimus. Mm-hmm. Cool. Two. One. Jeez. One. Two. One, two, three, four, five, six, ten. ten. Minus two is enough. See ya. And then Glyph Jumper will become screaming at the B. One, two. So, ten. Uh, taking eight. And that's enough. Yep. Awesome. So All right, cool. I'm more than happy to put this deck away now because it's dumb. <laughs> we we all we've seen on the stream. You can watch it in your leisure uh, when it's on YouTube. There that the deck is dumb, and I don't have it optimized. Nor am I probably playing it optimally, as uh, Eric has just pointed out. <clears throat> 
that deck was pretty severe. That, yeah. It's very explosive. Yeah. Yeah. It, it, it and it's consistently explosive. I mean, if you if you do you want me to So I don't have anything sleeved. I took everything apart so I could finish that project. Yep. So I can put something together if anyone wants to play against something specific. Yeah, I that's could fine. Slap together in uh, Insecticons, and you could pilot it against it if you wanted to try it against Insecticons to see. Right. Well, the Insecticons is a is a pretty good matchup because uh, there is a really good chance. Uh, I played. I watched this deck play against Insecticons, mm -hmm. and it it came down to like how the cards. Mm -hmm got drawn. Uh, it was very close every time, I, every match they played. Gotcha. Because uh, it's, they essentially work on the exact same principle. Yeah, no, exactly. Right. And they have up tap, untap effects that bugs don't. Yeah. And bugs have some slimy damage, undamage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, what, with this, from what that guy was playing, uh, I, th I think, cause, uh, um, and then instead of press the advantage, he had uh, peace through tyranny, um, oh, okay. but peace through tyranny was in a different deck, and I didn't feel like swapping it over. And press right. the advantage, if, in my in my head, works about the same. Um, it's not, but right. Well, it depends on whether or not you're in a tap out scenario yeah. against your opponent. It, press the advantage works the same as well because it's a double orange pip. Yeah, it's a double orange pip. Like, the whole reason for Press <laughs> the Advantage flip. to be in it is just the double orange pip. Or, you mean Peace Through Tyranny? Yeah. Because Press Through Advantage gives you plus the plus two. Yeah. And if right. it's Receptcon, minus two. Yes. For them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, That's the, the, function like, of the, yeah the function of the card is obviously different, but... Because... Beca and from... Oh, sorry. I, what I was missing in the conversation was... I was hearing double orange pip on Press the Advantage. I'm like, that I don't think is right. Why is there a giant yellow thing across the... Uh, not enough video. What? Um, I'm not sure what that is. But it's okay now. Okay. Anyway. Um. So, yeah. I mean, I see the arguments for why press can be in there, not oh, knowing what that so, list was. Yeah. So then I guess my suggestion would be, um... Either we just continue the stream, mm -hmm. and you, and then we just, I swap out, oh, wow. and then you play some bugs, or we could end the stream and then we could build some stuff and then come back with whatever we're gonna do. It's either either way is good with me. I don't, I don't care. I, I mean, while he's building, you can play that. I can literally grab my blue devastator deck and we can just play while he's building. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I mean, yeah. content's content. Yeah. Sounds good. All right. All right. People can what, see me play a, another deck completely terribly. Th I mean, th this, one's, the... this one's auto-piloted. <laughs> I, I, had, I had to barely read the cards to uh, to, to make it work. <laughs> what, what should I put together? What, what? So, Sean, since you don't get to play as much as I do or as much as Rich has, what would you like to play against? Uh, Insecticons. <laughs> or, or, or anything. No, no, no. I I can build that one very easily. I know the cards is what I was playing. Let's see if I can do this without looking up the list. Which I'll I'll throw the shout out to VectorSigma.info for the deck list of for Insecticons that I probably based all the times I've streamed it off of and that one that I played at the tournament and all the other fun stuff. Thank you for making Tournament deck list, a thing that people can look at and then steal and use as their own or build off of so that they have a starting point, which is... Sean and I have known each other for I don't even know how long, and basically, I'm not the best deck builder, but I can pilot things pretty well. I remember one day he came to me with an L5R deck and said, Hey, can we do this? I went, yes, and now I'm going to keep doing that because this is amazing. But I couldn't come up with that concept to save my life. Like, ever. So I appreciate that those things exist on VectorSigma.info and other places. Like, 
I guess, Wrecking Rule. Although, I can't figure out where Wrecking Rule deck lists usually are because I have to go to their blog and then I get lost in their blog and look at pictures of all of their... Uh, yes, yes, Wrecking Rule. Uh, take, take a note from Joe on your page and put your decks in a searchable uh, drop-down in your menu. I mean, you have great decks. I just don't want to go through your blog. Yeah. Because I tend to to just read it as you post stuff so I don't I don't want to go back through it to try to find where I happen to have saw that deck list at be like Joe Brian's going God, Brian, Brian, <laughs> you were telling me to do that uh, and then also uh, I think I think I got the core idea for this deck from Joe on his decks <laughs> Do you want to use my cool tower? Yes, let's use your cool tower. And let's... Do you, do you have the... There's that thing from when we used... Wesley from... What should we yep. call it? Forge of Solace. Forge of Solace, There we yep. go. Yay, Forge of Solace. 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 Forge of Solace. Yes. All right. Hmm. It was kind enough to hook us up with this cool stacking counter... And other stuff. Is it in the shot? Yes. Excellent. Excellent. All right, cool. So, let's do this. Yeah. And we do the rolls. Four. That was... Five. Um, that was uh, an eight. I will go first. Alrighty. We'll leave that right there then. One, two, three. Two, three. Uh, first things first. These boards so I can see them. We'll flip scrapper because <coughs> that is. <coughs> What I was informed I have to do by a nice guy who said I was playing the deck when it was orange completely wrong. If you happen to watch this, you know who you are. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then uh, Scrapper will uh, go at Bumblebee. Alrighty. Because three defense. <laughs> So four. What is happening? Four. You, you take two. That's weird. Yeah. I don't even know what's happening. I got, like, I think one of the only orange pips in the deck. <laughs> All right. And then it's our uh, little turn. Okay. Um... I think we'll flip Bumblebee. Well, going to crazy town. And then we're going to play this armed hovercraft on him. Yeah, that's, uh, that's good. That's good. Um... And then we'll go back into Scrapper. Yeah, it seems like a good plan. Bye, Scrapper. I love you. Uh. <laughs> well. I don't think it's going to be enough, though. Oh, maybe. So, three. Uh, at eight. So, I take five. You take oh, five. He's still around. He's still alive. He's still, still alive. hanging in there. Ah, that's so weird. <laughs> All right, and uh, we pass turn. Draw my card. To be 
fair, if you had been playing the orange version, he would have been squished. That's yes. true. Yes, he would have been squished. Um... We will flip hook and toss an armed hovercraft on him. All right. Because he's my only ranged person. <laughs> um, and then we shall... Attack Bumblebee. Alrighty. One, two, two. Um. So that's. So three. Three at the two. Take another one. So we're gonna clean this up and then make this four then. Oh. Or yeah, you're gonna make um, that four. And then I will toss a handheld blaster to get. Scoundrel's Blaster. <clears throat> All right, and then it's turn. Mm -hmm. And I'll draw. All right, and this is the part where we flip Optimus. So look at me, I got a gun. And... And what do we do? Is that a sound effect board? Yes. Yeah. Oh, it's a. Like it's like an everything board. board. Oh, excellent, excellent. That, are they doing the transforming sounds when yes. you flip them over? Yeah. Yes. And and the trans. If you've, I don't know if you've actually watched any of the videos. Um, I know you like the, you subscribe, but I don't know that we put mm -hmm. out enough while you're not busy. No, I I watched uh, I watched them in reruns, but uh, not with the volume on because I'm in the middle of a show usually. Uh, yeah. So the the board flip when it switches perspective it, it's also key to that and oh, okay. yep. nice it's pretty cool uh, so we're going to matrix him and I mean yeah I don't think we need anything else just yet so then we'll swing in Oh yeah, we'll uh, we'll definitely plasma burst uh, scrapper. But we're attacking hook. Cool. Okay, I'm this one. Oh, there he is. Dead. One of those goes on. <clears throat> cool. And then uh, is two. I'm sorry. What was yours? Eight, nine. Uh, just eight. Nine? Oh, yeah, nine. Sorry. Matrix. <laughs> Hello. I forgot that card. Now I can't see it. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Hook. It was nice knowing you. Give yourself another counter. Uh, tower track. Yep. When they yeah, die. You, get a, you get a tower when they die. Why? Scrapper? He, he was dead beforehand. It doesn't matter. It happens... It happens regardless if oh. it's in the KO or not. Yeah. Oh, so his his ability just keeps happening because he's in bot mode already. Yes. Yeah. Yep. If he dies, that's why before that... he transforms, you don't get the counter, but then you can transform him in the KO and then keep getting the counters. Otherwise, yeah. this deck would fall apart. So, so that explains why that guy said I was an idiot and I needed to to, to read all my cards better. <clears throat> I made the joke that I'm I'm Team RTFC. Uh, I'll draw a card. Oh, okay. um, for an action, we're going to vaporize the Matrix of Leadership. Alrighty. Because I hate that card. I mean, it's a great card if you're playing Optimus. Yeah. Battlefield Legend. Um, or Bumblebee. Or Bumblebee, yeah. Um, so I only flip one more guy this round, 
That will be Mixmaster and we will attach data bank to long haul. Okay. The Mixmaster will come screaming at Bumblebee. Alright. Because that's the best odds. So, uh, three. uh, three on two, I take one. Okay. Uh, the scavenger will attack the bee. All right. That's three on one, take two. All right. Bone crusher. Oh. Uh, so just one. Three up and one more. And then three. Three on two, take another one. All right. Oh. And then we do that and we all flip. On tap or whatever. And a draw. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so the start of my turn is when I draw my card, right? Correct. Cool. Hmm. For the record, I just want to say, I just went through this box to pull out the cards for Insecticons. I apparently built a 45-card deck that was your list. Seriously, how does that not happen? And I think it's just a matter okay. of not knowing... Oh, there's no... <clears throat> I mean, you, you can flip him for confidence and then dig if you get the extra action. That might be a good idea. All right. I mean, so we'll see. We'll see what happens there. No, yeah, it's not a terrible idea. Yep. So we'll <laughs> we'll flip Optimus to get the confidence, and then we'll play the confidence to draw the two cards. All right, and then discard two cards. And then we're gonna scrap two cards. Oh my god. Uh. Oh, okay. Well, that's one of them. That gets cut. All right. Okay, and then I get to play in action. So we're going to play a one stop stand. And we'll hit Mix Master with it. <clears throat> and then. We'll attack long haul with B. Um, should I do that? Should I do that? Yeah, we'll scrap to draw two. And then we'll flip. So that's seven coming in. Five, so I take two. Alrighty. All right. Oh. Did I say seven? Yes. I meant eight, because I forgot about the arm paragraph. Sorry. No, you're fine. <clears throat> Alright. Cool. And pass turn. Pep talk. Uh, 
Oh, and I draw a card from the long haul because he didn't die. Uh, Toss Scoundrel's Blaster on Bone Crusher. All right. Um, and he'll come at B. All right. So three, four, five, six. Defend two, take four. All right. So he's in danger. And I will scrap a card to add to my tower. And then that's it. May, may I point out to you, hmm. you need to do that when you declare the attack. Oh, okay. Just. All right. And then, the the, then that's it? I forget uh, that every yes. time I. All right. And come back this way, and I'll draw. When this attacks, yes. For some reason, I thought I read after, but I read that card six times before I went ahead and did that, and I still uh, did it wrong. No, I, I do the same thing the first two or three times I go to do it, and I'm like, damn it, I forgot. Um, and the first time someone tells you in a tournament, no, you can't, you go, no, I'm not going to forget that, and I played that two tournaments ago. Oh, no, I already screwed up. I didn't flip. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we're going to leap of faith. We'll scrap. Um, I don't really want to swap missions. No, that would be bad. Yeah. Uh, so we're not going to so do that. It goes to oh, it scrap. goes to the scrap. Yep. And then we're going to scrap to play confidence. Where we draw two. And then. We scrap two. Uh. Yeah. So there's no way to win the game now for me because I didn't flip. So I can't. So I could flip two this turn and then next turn still have someone to flip uh, but now I'm two turns behind and that's enough to cack all the guys I guess we're gonna scrap scrap these and then I can play an action Oh, Plasma Burst Long Haul. Um, That's why you drew a, car a card off of Long Haul when he didn't die. I was like, yeah. how? I don't I didn't see the data bank. Yeah. And then we'll flip Optimus. And then we'll attack Bone Crusher with Optimus. I forgot to do that. Um, shuffle immediately. We're shuffling. I mean, I can. <clears throat> yep, yeah, now you can shuffle. We can all shuffle together. Yeah. I'm shuffling also. Thanks. Yeah. And out of nowhere, Insecticons come, swarms the board. Game over. Well, no. I no. Mean, at this point, it would be game over because yeah. you just have to. You have to say when you do. You have to say energon, energon, because you know that double speak just really did it for me. All right. 
So we're going to do that. All right. And out of this, we... So wait, you flipped. You well, just, it doesn't matter. I'm, just keep going, yeah. All right, I'm resolving the leap out of the file. Yeah. He was just doing it because then he could do it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> sure. Um, I'll vaporize the scoundrel's blaster. Um, I don't have another action, so the rest of that fizzles. And then we'll flip. Um, and we'll play the steamroll. Are we done? Yeah. No, yeah. this this deck had no, statistically, no chance against uh, uh, Optimus. But it was fun, nonetheless. This deck needs another expansion to get more cards. <clears throat> yeah, also, hopefully. Also, Wizards of the Coast, give me Bruticus. Yeah. Bruticus. Or yeah. at least make the Constructicons not lame. I want to love them, but you make it difficult. I don't know. I love them. <clears throat> well, I love them. They're just not going to win much. I guess. So, yep. who am I playing? And well, I should not play against Rich. Okay. Yeah, are you, yeah, are you playing Bugs? Yeah. No. <laughs> I'll see ya. These... <laughs> They're running away. <laughs> They're running away. It's official. They're running away. They don't like bugs? We, oh my god, no. We played last night, and we had less than a 35-minute stream playing two games. And we talked for eight minutes during yeah, it. No. Before. Or after. Or both. Or it was both. a really fast game. Yeah, it was... He swings in, somebody dies, I swing, I... Maybe deal some damage. He swings in. The other person dies. It's okay, to it's be done. To be very fair, that second game though was just statistically messy because you should have killed two, on two different attacks and you yes. missed it by one. Yeah, that's true. That's true. So it could have gone a lot better, but it didn't. So anyway. Yeah, I want to play against that. Oh yeah. I don't know how to do this without oh, knocking yeah. everything over. Eric is a giant person. Just, I got it. I got it. You just say Eric smash as you walk through. Yeah, but I don't want to smash our equipment. Oh, well, yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Our equipment costs money. Anyone want to order? Uh, yes, please. Yes, Thank please. You. Thank you very much. I actually brought some, but they're somewhere behind shop. I'll take it because it's cold. Yes, well, that, that is a bonus, too. Okay. Hey, Rich. Yeah. Do you want to man the stream deck since I don't actually know how it works, even though it's really cool and I want to play with it? Absolutely. I will do that. And then you should teach me how to do it for the next time I'm sitting there not building a deck while we're while you guys are playing. Uh, yeah, I that's just, true. Yeah. I was building the deck, so I couldn't really. Yeah. Yeah. Hi, everyone. It's Eric. Yay, Eric. I just made the Sean face. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> you don't? <laughs> <laughs> I thought I'm referring to it that I'm like, well, you know. <laughs> I haven't seen Sean in I don't even know how long. Uh, many, many months. Seven months, maybe? Six, seven, eight months, something like that. It's just been a really long time. Yeah, it's been a long time. Yeah. It went from, it, you know, because it went for years of seeing us once or twice every week. Yep. To every couple to driving months. six or seven hours to tournaments and cuddling at night I don't know if we actually ever did that uh, you just, that was just Alejandro oh right 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 okay he, he was surprised to see me at back at Target he was just like what I bet has he has he failed at working for his dad's company? I have no idea. I didn't, really. I'm going to adjust this camera. If you're watching this, Alejandro, I had faith in you. I, I mean, think this might be straight now. Okay. I think it was off kill because right, scrap no flips first, because then you're like, haha, I can't take more than three damage. Yeah. I tried playing Insecticons, <laughs> and I was just I was really bad at it. 
Me too. I mean, against Rich, I'm pretty good. <laughs> unfortunately. Because we played in the tournament, and that was my first win for the for the tournament. But it was round three. Mm. So you know the downside? I can't see where your deck is. Oh, <laughs> I said good day, sir. Good day. Yeah, when one of my <clears throat> one of the guys I work with uh, saw that I played, as he called it, uh, those card games. Mm. He asked if I if I sleeved them, and I was like, yeah, of course I sleeved them. Like some of those cards are worth money. Uh, the I said good day, sir, is from Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, which is important since I work for Charlie and the Chocolate Factory National Tour, coming to a city near you. Pretty good. <laughs> good. Or was already at a city near you. Well, yeah, it's already been near here. It's not coming back. It's mm. on the West Coast right now. <clears throat> uh, no, it comes back in the fall. I think Wista is the closest it gets. Sure. I don't yeah. even know where that where is. Wista? Massachusetts. Okay. Well, that's a little bit of a track, but it's, you know, it's good think, times. Yeah, I think that's the closest. Are you ready? Would you like to roll to see who goes first? Oh, sure. Yeah. Two dice. Sure. Five. It's ten. I will choose to go first. <laughs> yes, you will. I'm going to figure Dude. out who's at the door. All right. It's probably Gigi. Because it was shaving a haircut. Draw my card for the turn. Transform Scrap Null. Swing Scrap Null at... Um, uh, I don't know. Who's the bigger threat? Uh, at the start, they're all pretty equal. It says the... Yeah. Uh, we'll swing at Wheeljack. So that's seven. Take four. Table is yours. Thank you. Gonna draw my card. Put that right there. Um. We will. Upgrade Prowl. Mm -hmm. Draw a card. Scrap one. Um, and then we'll flip Prowl and draw a card from Cliff Jumper. Uh, and then Prowl will come at Scrap Null. Cool. Would you like to plan anything? Uh, no. I'm going to not plan. Okay. Uh, you dig three. Yes. <laughs> it was pretty... Uh, and I will scrap mining pick to take press the advantage mm -hmm. in my hand. And it is you, sir. Draw a card. Oh, well, it's not. It, that is not a grenade it's not launcher. Grenade launcher, <laughs> which my head told me it was. And mm. It's not. Yeah. Um. I play grenade launcher on kickback. Transform kickback. 
let's see. There's a button. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what button this is. I, I can't operate the deck. I also... We're, we're now stuck on whatever frame it was on before. Rich, you should have taught me how to use the deck. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know either. All right, Kickback's gonna swing at Prowl. Where's the cheat sheet? Um, I'm gonna flip six cards. I'm gonna flip eight cards. Eight cards. Two for the attack. Six additional. Why six additional? So when this is attacking, flip two more battle cards. Oh, for each. For each. So. Two for the attack, and then two extra for each thing. So one, two, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because I can't reach around this camp this microphone very easily. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's a total of twelve. Twelve. I will take ten. Goodbye, sweet prowl. Table is yours. Cool. Um, draw my card. Uh, we will mm -hmm. launch on wheeljack. Draw a card. Uh, Rene, like oh, yeah, one. thank you. Yep. There's being gone. I will then flip him, draw a card. Um, and then. So, what's up? So, correct me if I'm wrong, because this is activated now, it's floating. If I flip him back over, it's still there until the end of this turn. Because it says, well, I have a weapon in the scrap pile, this has bold three. So, I have a card effect that flips him back over. So,. I don't know. We'll just go as it is now. It's I the only reason I don't know is because that seems like it's a static check that's checking. It I, it could be. Yeah, and I don't know, but it's a good question. Yeah, that yeah, it's fine. I don't mind asking other people. Yeah. Uh, but he will come screaming at kickback. Oh yeah, uh, who's gonna get pulped? Yep. One, two. One, two, three. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, ten, fourteen. Yeah. yeah. See, so he was already off the board. Cool. And I right. uh, didn't play an action, so it's all you. Right. Draw a card. Um... Rich's response was like, I know, sorry, I got this guy out here. And I'm like, well, do I need to go take care of this guy that's out there? Yeah. Um, we're going to transform Barrage. You have Barrage and Mining Pick. Um, and we're going to swing Barrage at Wheeljack. And we're going to choose the plan. We're going to plan. Let's see. We're going to plan two. 
So that's six, seven, eight for the two plans. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13 for the bold two that he has because Wheeljack has damage. Yes. So you should flip your defense though. Flip, oh. Well, yes, more than enough to kill him, still sometimes. And the table's yours. Cool. Uh, I'll draw a card. Force field on him. Sure. Flip him. So he, uh... His plus two, plus two? Yeah. Um... No. Or plus two attack. He's currently plus zero, plus zero, because I don't have cars. Oh. Uh, but... Got it. With my action... Uh... I will... Play... Rollout, which flips all of my characters from bot mode to alt mode. It doesn't affect cards in the KO. That's dumb. So, what you could do... No, that wouldn't work. Because then it would flip him back, so it really wouldn't matter. Because he is the same no matter what. Um, so, I will... So, I'll just leave him that way. Uh... We'll flip Wheeljack. Okay. So if I do turn him. Um, let's see, for my action. Um, we'll play Press the Advantage. Mm -hmm. uh, drop his sure. at one, and then we'll swing at you. Mm -hmm. One, two, one. Eleven? Uh, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Yep. It's enough to kill him by the fact that you had that minus two defense. All right. Mine. Yep. Draw my card. Um. Play Static Laser of Ironhide on Ransack. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to transform. I'm going to swing Ransack at Cliff Jumper. Four, six, seven, eight. And deal two damage to him. Nope. That's. How much did you oh, do defense? You did eight. Uh. So I take six. That's what I was doing. No, it pops the force field and you only take four. Oh. Oh, it auto pops force field. Okay. Yes. Right, yes. Rain. No, so good. And now we untap. And the table is yours. Draw a card. Um... We will I'll flip wheeljack back to bot mode so I can draw a card. Looking at the wording, like, I understand why the action has to be played before the attack. Uh, mm. So, um, actually, no, we will put that. 
smashing shield. There is no armor to scrap. Nope. Um, and he will come screaming at Ransack. So that's six. Four, six, yep. That's enough to kill him because of that two damage. Oh, wait, hang on. Wait, he did six. Yeah. I only take four because he has two defense, which I'm not used to. Wow. Yes. All right. Now, the problem is attacking with attack laser or Ironhide is going to kill him, so... Yes. That's problematic. All right, let's draw a card. But that's... I mean, that's the play, though, because you have two untapped characters, and you only need to get eight damage across. No, but static laser of Ironhide Doesn't will matter. kill him. Doesn't matter. You have two untapped characters, and you need to do eight damage, statistically... Right, but if I attack with him... And he dies, who cares? And he doesn't get the attack. He dies because the damage is put on him before you flip any... When the upgraded character is not Ironhide and it attacks due to damage to it. So oh, he's going to so die. It's, instant, it's instantaneous. Yeah, so he's going to die. That's dumb and good. It's dumb and good. <clears throat> I. That makes so much more sense now, because... And that means that one of the people I was playing against the other day on Skype was playing horribly and correctly. Possibly. Yeah. Because they definitely at the very end were like, and two damage. And I wasn't looking at the card. Oh, no, yeah. no. So Reckless Charge puts the damage on at the end of the turn. Static Laser does it when you declare the attack. So, and seeing as I did not draw anything that I can replace that with, we're instead going to play Peace Through Tyranny, KO Ransack, to take an extra turn after this one. And then we're going to take Scrapnel, and we're going to attack Cliff Jumper for seven. So I take four? No, the defense. Oh, defense. The chances of flipping. So take four. <laughs> And now they untap, and now I get an extra turn because of the piece through tyranny. They both untap? Yeah, because yeah. everyone's tapped. Ah. And then I will play Mining Pick, attack Scrapnel, plan two, that goes there, one, two. Yeah. So, yeah. Yeah, because there was just... No chance. Yeah. No. If I go first, I stand a better. I I think it's a sixty percent chance of winning, versus Insecticons. And if you go first, it's a sixty percent chance of winning against this deck. At least that's what I was. Uh, the guy was explaining to me. Okay. Is this dude a buck rich? Like, yeah. is it a Jehovah's Witness? Yo, if it was, tell me. I will come upstairs and we will just. I don't know that I can bring the camera upstairs, but.
My assumption is you're going first. Yes. Okay. Uh, we'll flip. I'll move these guys up a little bit so I can actually see them. We'll flip Prowl. Yep. Draw my card. Um, you should have four cards. Oh, yes. Thank so, you. So, yeah. That's cool. Last turn I was down one card, too, because my brain doesn't... I forget to draw a card more times than I'd care to admit. <clears throat> Especially playing this deck, because I'm like, ah, oh, cards! I draw yeah. cards! I draw cards! Just not my normal card draw. Um, so Prowl will come screaming into Scrapnel. Okay. Because he's, he's a target right now. Seven. Okay, four. Cool. Mine? Yep. Draw a card. Transform Scrapnel. Put a grenade launcher on Scrapnel. Attack Prowl with Scrapnel. Seems like a good play. Uh, it is 11. That is enough for him to die. Goodbye, Prowl. Sleep well, sweet prince. <clears throat> and table is yours. Drop a card. Uh... Take three, so I'm gonna ask him if it's Jehovah's Witness. Should I call him? Yeah, maybe. Um, I put a mining pick on Wheeljack, so. Draw a card, and then I scrap a card, and then what's this guy? Do we need to come outside and? Oh, that we were just trying to make sure you were okay. Okay. Bye. Okay. I don't know. Rich just got super like, yeah, 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 yeah. And I'll come outside. What you doing? Uh, Your ISO function does not go to the scrap when you play it. It sits around. Yeah. Okay. Really, um, only makes a difference when we're about to shuffle. Yep. Sure, give everyone bold too. Yep. Um, sure. Yeah. And then. Uh, and then wheel jack. No, I should attack with Prowl. Cause Absolutely, because he's going to die. Yes. My, yes. Yeah, I, I eventually get there. Going at Scrapnel. Yeah, kill Scrapnel. One, two, one, two. Enough to kill him. And then Prowl dies. All right, my turn? Yes. Draw a card. Um... Play one shall stand, one shall fall. Deal three damage to Wheeljack, and Ransack is going to take three damage. I'm going to transform Barrage. I'm going to put a grenade launcher on Barrage. I'm going to swing Barrage at Wheeljack. One, two. Bold, two from Wheeljack having damage. So, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen, eleven. That's just enough to kill him. Table's yours. Thank you. Draw a card. Now this is where Wheeljack being in uh, 
or them being in bot mode or car mode helps Cliff Jumper. Yes. Yeah. Um. You all. We will grenade launcher down. Draw a card, right? Because that's still functioning. I I guess. Well, if they're always when you upgrade one of your cars, like is that? I don't I don't know. All right. I. I follow the logic for why it should, so I'm down with you doing it. I don't actually know, because I never thought of that being a thing. Okay. Hello. Hi. So, is Rich outside in front of the house? Okay. Okay. Can you give me just a second, because we're finishing a game on camera, and I will be upstairs. It's okay. Wait, we've... Rich left in the middle of it. We're kind of stranded because he's not operating the, any of the things. So, um, but yeah, just give me a second and I'll be outside. No problem. Bye. So no, because Scrapper specifically says if he's in the KO. So that's why he still works in KO. Yes. No one else does. So that the effects. Sure. I don't know. Right there. Um. That makes sense also to me. Yeah. No. I don't know. I haven't really. But we will, since they're both in car modes, yeah. flip him over. He's a big um, dude now. Yeah, he is a big dude. Uh, he should absolutely also get to plus defense. But he, yeah, you know, he, he just he, gets the attack. Just gets the attack. Um, plus defense would be berserker. Um, let's see, he's at five, six, seven, eleven. Eleven. Before going at barrage. So I'll just press the advantage yep. just to make sure that uh, Barrage is super dead. Let's go away. Two. And we'll toss that back in my hand. That goes away. Oh, you. Draw a card. Um... Transform, kick back, play swarm. One, two, three, four. Kickback's going to swing it at cliff jumper. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Do your flips. So, oh. So. Take six. Take six. And then, <laughs> ransom. <laughs> four. It's okay. It's all good. These are not the decks to teach with. No, no, no. These are not the decks to teach with. Well, thank you everyone for joining us. Pippin, thank you for serenading us with craziness. Um, yeah, sorry about all of that right at the end. Um, but thank you for joining us. We will... Uh, Post the next time we're doing something, if it's in a little while, if it's later tonight, if it's another day. Sean, thank you for joining us. Oh, thank you. Um, it, was, it, it was very nice to have one of the founding other members of Team RTFC to sit down, even though... Mark, we miss you. Yeah, we do miss you, Mark. Although Mark doesn't isn't on Facebook, so he doesn't know that we do any of this stuff. So He's on YouTube. I don't know. You him I have to, I'd have to like text him and do all that stuff, so... Um, Rich arrived again. Sorry that we weren't flipping things around. I don't know how to press the buttons. I don't know what buttons to press. So Sorry. I still got upstairs since yep. the guy's still here. So. All right. Uh, what do I hit to end this? End the stream. End stream. Thank you, everyone, for joining us. Ooh, figure it out.